I know that you are in Indianapolis, and so you're seeing what's going on on both the men's side and the women's side. And unfortunately, things on the women's side have not been good lately. And on social media, there's been a bit of an uproar over the way the women's weight room is compared to the men's weight room. In case you haven't seen it, there have definitely been, been uh, videos that have come out about it, and it just shows the very vast difference. There you see it. On the left-hand side is the women's weight room. On the right-hand side is the men's weight room. I mean, it doesn't take a genius to see that these two are completely different. Um, there's a video that's now been viewed over 10 million times on Twitter, and we're about to show it to you here. Check it out. I got something to show y'all. So for the NCAA March Madness, the biggest tournament in college basketball for women, this is our weight room. Let me show y'all the men's weight room. Now, when pictures of our weight room got released versus the men's, the NCAA came out with a statement saying that it wasn't money, it was space that was a problem. Let me show y'all something else. Here's our practice court, right? And then here's that weight room. And then here's all this extra space. If you aren't upset about this problem, then you're a part of it. Okay, so since Oregon Sedona Prince's video has been released, this was uh, the statement from the NCAA that she mentioned. It says, we acknowledge that some of the amenities teams would typically have access to have not been as available inside the controlled environment. In part, this is due to the limited space, and the original plan was to expand the workout area once additional space was available later in the tournament. That was by Lynn Holtzman, VP of NCAA Women's Basketball. She since has said they fell short and it will be remedied by tomorrow. And one can only hope. So, Harry, we're going to bring you back in for this. And I just want to get your thoughts on it because, I, quite frankly, I just didn't like that we're passing blame here. I mean, this is very, very obvious that something is wrong and that the women's should have been remedied a long time ago. But nonetheless, since you are there in Indianapolis, I'd like your thoughts. You know, honestly, it's just sad. I mean, at this point, you know, like there have been amazing strides, especially in recent memory the past few years where people are trying to make the necessary strides in order to bring women's basketball in particular, uh, you know, to a level where we treat it the same as men's basketball. Mm -hmm. And, you know, the NCAA, <laughs> I think a lot of us would say that they don't do a whole lot, right? But, I mean, you look at this and it's just flagrant at this point. I mean, like, it's, it's just sad that to see the pictures and for them to try to say, well, you know, it's an honest mistake. And then you see the, all the extra space that they actually had. Um, it, it's honestly disheartening. If you're a sports fan, you should be upset about this. Mm -hmm. And, you know, I know there hasn't been a ton of them, but if you're one of these keyboard warriors who are saying, well, the women don't need all those weights anyways, the women that are using those weights can kick your butt. So, like, <laughs> let's, let's, let's advance this, right? Let's, let's, let's make the necessary changes. Everybody's equal. We all love sports, right? So, like, let's treat everybody fair. Yeah. It's and the right thing is, to do. This is the the game, the, the big the big stage. So it, everyone should be treated equally for that. And you've been around all of the players. Have you heard of or seen any more of an outcry or protest to this issue? I've just seen, you know, it's. The, I think the thing that's been very good to see is is beyond uh you know the both the men's and women's tournaments and seen a lot of pro nba players speaking out i know obviously we all know you know kobe bryant before he passed uh you know was a very big advocate for the women's game and i think that that stuck with a lot of guys in the nba today and you've seen they're like hey like you know why would you even think to do this to not give them what they need because it's not a luxury right if mm -hmm. it's something that the men are getting it's something that the women should get mm -hmm. and so i think that's been one of the better things that have come out of this is to see that everybody's really you know realizing like hey like this is serious like it's, it's not cool and you know we all just want the same things and i want to you know we should all want to see everybody do great including women yeah that's mm -hmm. true harry lyles thanks so much for the insight we appreciate it enjoy indianapolis and enjoy the rest of the tournament thanks guys Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.